Welcome to our tutorial on how to quickly highlight those cells or rows that have a date that is a weekend date. I'm using the text function to extract the name of the day from the date. OK, copy the formula down. If you are using conditional formatting with formulas, it is much easier to work with numeric values. I'm using the weekday function. The first argument is the date I want to check. The second argument is the return type. I'm going to choose 2 because in this case, it takes Monday is 1, Tuesday is 2, Wednesday is 3, and so on. Copy the formula down. I want to highlight all those rows where the weekday number is either 6 or 7. Select the range and apply conditional formatting. Click conditional formatting and select the new rule option. Choose the following option. Use a formula to determine which cells to format. Then paste the weekday formula. Modify the formula. I want to make sure that column B is locked, so add a dollar sign before the column alphabet, which is B. So this makes sure that when analyzing each cell in a row, it is still referring back to column B which has the date. The value should be greater than 5 because I want these numbers to be 6 or 7. Click the format button and choose a color. I'm using a green fill color. OK, the result looks great. To check holidays, simply look up data from the holidays sheet. Type VLOOKUP and use the date in B3 as a lookup value. Select the lookup array and lock this range using the dollar sign. Then the column index is 1 because there's just one column in the table area. Finally, I'm looking for an exact match. Copy the formula down. Finally, use the isNumber function to get true and false Boolean values. Now, create a new conditional formatting rule and paste the formula to highlight all the records where the date is a holiday. In this case, I'm choosing another fill color. Conditional formatting highlights this row because we have only one date that is a holiday. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more tips, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned.